Welcome back. We have Wanda Massengale in for the Ozarks Humane Society, and you want to introduce your yes, I do Christmas her, present. <laughs> her name is Josie. She Look is eight her. weeks old. Her adoption fee is forty dollars, and she's part um, boxer and husky on her mother's side. Her dad, no one knows. And she is such an adorable oh, little baby. Yeah. Look at that. Mm. She's got her Christmas bow on. She's ready <coughs> for you to take home. And she's her she's her. What happened to her tail? Well, she was born that way. Oh and my gosh! Dog. And the Humane Society has had the mother and the puppies since they were the puppies were three days old. Oh my! Oh goodness! goodness. So Pretty puppy. She's definitely loves. The she looks belly. like she's look that belly. looks like she raised just about every dog bowl that comes out. <laughs> She's, she's, she's healthy. Uh -uh. No, she's not. And she's had all of her shots. She's too young right now to fix, but she will get <coughs> that. And if someone adopts her, other than maybe me, uh, oh. <laughs> uh, then uh, they'll receive a voucher and with a date set up for the spay and neuter clinic. You need mm -hmm. to turn around. And the next spay and neuter clinic is the end of January. It's January 26th, 27th, and 28th. And the table will be set up at calls for Paul's a week before that for applications. Like she is just precious. <laughs> and right now the Humane <coughs> Society is still doing the angel trees. Okay. okay. Where um, people can go get an envelope off of the tree with the pet's picture and donate whatever they wish and keep the picture for their tree or for their family. Or and whatever. where is that? Yeah, where, where can we do and that? And they are at Nature's Wonders, Harrison Animal Clinic. Hudson's Grocery and Calls for Paws. Okay. Okay. Oh. Isn't she cute? She wants to go home with you, Wanda. <laughs> I don't know what Teddy Bear would do, but I sure would like it. And she's still got the puppy breath. Which the I, puppy yeah. breath. Yes. Have you ever smelled that? I, I don't know. Oh, There's yeah. nothing bad about puppy breath. No, no. it's not. Oh. It's just that she's real young. And do you she's have any idea baby. how big she'll get? No, I don't. Is that I, your only reason for not? Well, Teddy Bear um, is an only dog, like an only child. <laughs> I'm not sure. You he throw will, someone in there, it might be a... Yeah, it might be a little different. Mm. Uh, he's, uh, he loves the horses and things, but... I oh, they'll get along. You think? <coughs> is Teddy Bear a girl or a boy? <laughs> it's a boy. He's a Norwegian elk hound. That's why he likes mm. the cold so well. Mm -hmm. But um, I wanted to mention again about donations to the feed store for food mm -hmm. and Dr. Melton's office for vet care if anyone wanted to okay. do that. The, um, you know, just like everywhere else, things break down. Sure. And if any service person wanted to call the Humane Society and say, you know, I'm a plumber, I'm an electrician. Okay. And um, put my name down. If you need something, call me. And if I can, I'll fix it. That's and a good then, idea. That is definitely yeah, a good idea. And then idea. the Humane Society will give a paper for a tax write-off as well. Yeah. But I did <coughs> check into the water situation because um, they're on well, you know, and when the power is off, that means the yeah. well's oh, not wow. working. Mm -hmm. And the uh, people that work there have to go to their homes and haul the water for yeah. all wow. the pets. Yeah. And if anyone's ever hauled water for any reason, it's a job. Definitely. Mm -hmm. It is yeah. definitely a job. And so I asked to see if uh, the Humane Society had generators or needed generators, and they really do. Uh, Butch Mollick put in, donated a um, furnace for the Humane Society and put it in for mm -hmm. them, mm -hmm. and he said he uh, fixed it where a generator could be plugged into it. Oh, because wonderful. If, wow. a fur if there's no power, then there's no heat. Yeah. Right. So they actually definitely need two generators, oh, at least one for the heat mm -hmm. and one for the water. Wow. But that is something I wanted to look into. And um, if anyone has, this sounds funny, I'm sure, but buckets, because it, uh, unless they get generators and they think the power is going off for weather related or whatever, they're going to have to draw water up. Right. So if yeah. anyone has right. any buckets around, mm -hmm. you know, they could donate them. And I asked about what they need, and they're needing towels again and, and washcloths. They need cleaning supplies, uh, detergents, dog toys, cat toys. <laughs> Another thing I asked about was, um, you know, with Christmas vacation, and it, we're, we've really got lovely weather. If uh, families wanted to go out there and take dog treats and cat treats and toys and leave the toys there for the pets and just go Play. go looking, like, mm -hmm. you know, go shopping for pets and playing with the dogs yeah. and cats and just have a good outing. 
Mm -hmm. Endless ways to help. There is. It <laughs> yeah. never, it never ends. <clears throat> and did you mention that people can go by the feed store and yes, and, and pay for at Pal Feed. Pal Feed, and yeah. Then pay for the food or hay or whatever. Whatever. Needs, yeah. Um, I know that they also appreciate just getting different brands of uh, pet food. Cats eat anything. Mm -hmm. Dogs, however, sometimes even though they like to keep them on a certain food, and some you can't trade off. Right. Some animals right. they get in are very finicky so it's nice to have uh -huh. another bag of something around right. to see if you can get them to eat mm -hmm. because if they're finicky they'll just eat what they have to because they're hungry but they won't yeah. they don't, no, they don't, they don't like, like it, it. Yeah. and they'll, Zippy's they'll pretty, way. my dog Zippy's pretty finicky he, he'll only have two eggs bacon oh, uh, biscuit good? and gravy for eggs breakfast. did you say yeah. oh well then <laughs> <laughs> a dog eats better than I do <laughs> you needed more than a dozen didn't you yeah I need more than a dozen well, Wanda, we appreciate it, and this is Josie, and she is available now, and uh, uh, forty dollars to adopt her. Right. That that means you get all the shots, shots and then bring her and back to and, and bring her back to get spayed or neutered. But yeah. the animals at the Humane Society and I have you each something for Christmas. Oh my okay. goodness! Because we really appreciate. Uh, well, thank you. What you do for well, us? Well, you gave uh, what you you gave us name tag. a name tag. Aww. My name tag is on Zippy, so he's he's. Oh, how sweet! That is adorable, Limley pet. Maybe Look at there. And Zippy, she knows I have more than one. Limley pets. <laughs> Limley pet. <laughs> so, oh, that is precious. That well, is absolutely precious. Well, thank precious. you very much. Thank you're welcome. You're so thoughtful. thoughtful. We you know, you're not supposed to wear those. Is this a tail then? <laughs> yes, <laughs> that's the tail. We really appreciate it <coughs> because I have been told that um, people will go out there and they may not be interested in the pet that was on the show, and they might be, mm -hmm. but they also just go looking around to see what pet they want. Well, well, that's and good. That's because that of both of you. people and, and that the Humane Society pets are benefiting. We're here to sure. jog your memory. That's what we do. And to show you adorable Christmas presents. That might fit in a bigger stock. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Wanda. We appreciate it. Thank you. And you have a great Thank holiday. You. Thank you. You too. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Merry to, Christmas to you. <clears throat> and you, Josie. <laughs> and that does it for us uh, for this year. Actually, we're going to take off uh, till January. Till after January, we're going to take, okay. take spend some time with the holidays and away from doing the program for a while. And we want to wish everyone out there a happy holiday and a fabulous new year. Hopefully it's going to be a great year next year. I want to wish you a happy holiday. Merry Christmas to Merry you, Merry Christmas Dan. to you. Thank you very much. Thank you. And from all of us here at Hometown Television, wishing you and your family the most prosperous new year and a great Merry Christmas from all of us to all of you. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again after the first of the year. <laughs>